juice I'm going to unbox and evaluate is KHRD72. It's an extremely popular model in China. It is told that Kumbo sold 50,000 pairs within three months of this shoe. And that's why it could be easily found everywhere I go to play badminton in a random hall in China. Many known badminton gurus is also using this exactly model. Let's unbox the shoes and see how it looks like. The color of KHR D72, it follows my preference of simplicity. Even though it has these colors, I still believe that it looks quite simple. It consists of this red and the white, and then there are some sparkles in the white, actually here on top, and then of course the blue logo that says combo. And that's basically the design. Right now it's snowing outside, so I just want to see how white the shoe actually is. So let's try and see. Oh, it's cold. Okay, so I managed actually to get some snow on the shoe. Yeah, the snow is obviously this, and it's basically the same color as snow. So if you have snow where you live, you can try to see how that will match your outfit. So the bottom anti-torsion system is of course this material you can see everywhere. It's only in one piece, which makes it extra solid. Even though I try to bend it very, very hard, there is nothing to be seen. It really keeps your foot intact. They cost this one system GPU. Other shoes will have this uh, when trying to bend it. It will actually be quite easy to bend over here, which don't give you the same support as the white one we have here. You cannot see any deformation or anything like that. It still looks the same and stays the same all the time. It is a must wear a good badminton shoe to minimize the chance of getting an injury. Let us try to put them on my feet and see how they do. As here you can see the front, the sides and the back of the shoe. So I must say that these shoes fit my feet very very well. The inner caution feels great and comfortable. Don't have to be concerned about the support of the shoe. I tried to test this out as you can see here. There is nothing to worry about because the shoe actually keeps my feet intact all of the time. There are four color options in general. All the color options is looking great but I must say that the white or the black these two are my favorites. As we know it's not enough that a, a badminton shoe is looking good we need to test it out on the course. So let's take a deeper look into the professionalism of these shoes. several matches and I have this feeling of great stability. No matter anti-slippery, supportive and anti-torsion makes me very happy to have them on my feet. And that's especially when I do fast movements, I can totally forget on my feet and focus on my technique moving around. What is cool about these shoes is that I cannot really feel any shock to my knees when I jump hardly or powerful around on the court. Because this shoe has a very huge impact on how your knees feel after you play it. And these shoes did a very good job not giving me any difficult with my knees after any training session. So that was perfect. The space of the shoes, the front of the shoes fit my feet very, very well. Even the times I played for more, that could be matches or training sessions. I didn't feel any pressure towards my toes. They were staying comfortable all of the time. That was very, very nice. And plus, they didn't feel hot either. So that means it's very comfortable to wear and very professional having it on your feet because you can actually last playing for a long period of time. The white shoe looks really, really nice, but it sometimes gets dirty. If you mind your shoes getting dirty, you may rip it to one of the other colors that I just showed because they are going to get dirty, but when they're not dirty, they look very, very good. Most of the materials on the shoe's surface is fabric. I could assume that it breathes very good and it feels very light at hand. Personally, I don't like wearing any heavy shoes because a heavy shoe simply slows down my movement. I think this type of model, especially the weight, is perfect for me. The inner sides and the outer sides is very improved in this model. It has been thicker and stronger 
And what I mean is all of these layers around the side is, is actually where the uh, shoe normally tend to break first. With this model, it's kind of improved all the way around. It's really thoughtful to, to kind of strengthen the parts that, that has the bigger chance to break first. I was told that Combo manufactures all their shoe at their own factories and they are particular about every quality control. From the four colors uh, of shoes that I've received, there has been no problems with the surface. There has been no parts where the glue kind of is, is mushed out or something like that. So that gives me a feeling of the manufacturing process of this model is very, very high. A cool little thing about this shoe is it has some kind of a heel stabilizer. It feels like some kind of a shield to kind of protect my heels. There are many movements in badminton that requires that your heel have to kind of land first, which is very demanding and tough for your heel. That's why I think it's very important and very clever thinking that they kind of make this part more solid so I don't have to be worried about uh, injuring or damaging my feet when moving around on the court. In general, I've reviewed this shoe because it has so good reputation in China. I think it's a good shoe with professional features and it's very good looking. If it is on your like, you may refer to this product review and give these shoes a try. Thanks for watching this review of this shoe from Combo.